Hi everyone, welcome to a Stamping to Share video. My name is Kay Kaltoff and today I'm going to share with you how I made this cute little flower for this really bright and friendly card. The flower comes from our pop-up posies kit and I will show you, I have to run over and get it, my pop-up posies kit is almost gone so I'm going to show you in the catalog. This is our spring mini catalog, page 18. And it comes with, with a type, well it comes with lots of good things, but the, the little cupcake liners and the bright yellow fabric colored brads are what I'm going to use today to make my flower. And so this is the one we're going to create. Now the, the little cupcake liners, which are so cute and I would have never thought to make flowers out of these, but of course at Stampin' Up! they think out of the box. First they have um, a very mini size, and then they also have kind of a medium size which looks like this and then they have a larger size here and what we're going to need is one of the large size and three of the medium size and then one of the yellow fabric colored brads so the first thing that you do is you just fold your medium size cupcake liners in half and so you'll do that for all three of them and you'll have something that looks like this. Then you take your paper piercing tool and you're going to make your first paper pierce about like this so that it's just a little bit to the inside of the folded liner. So we'll do that with all three of them like that and then you take your larger one and you spread it all out like this and you just put a hole right through the center. So now you take your brad and you just put it right inside the three holes that you made. So there's one, two, three and you can see how we have the starting of a flower. Then we put it through the last one and we get those brad legs open here and there's your flower and you can go ahead and put this on with a glue dot or you can actually pierce through the card and adhere the brad directly to the card which is what I did in this case and then on the inside of the card I just go, went ahead and decorated it with some more paper to hide to hide the brad legs and so that's how you do it. Hope you're having a great day and thank you so much for stopping by Stamping to Share. Bye-bye.